What's going on guys, My Minecraft here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys the new Minecraft Snapshot 13W02A, or commonly known as Minecraft 1.4.8. As of January, uh, this would be the new update. So guys, if you like this, please give it a like, leave a comment in the description, I will reply, and give, uh, just, just please subscribe for more videos. Uh, I also take requests and different things. So yeah, guys, uh... Yeah, so I'm going to get started. First of all, I'm going to start off with the de decoration. Nether quartz ore obviously can be found in the nether. Block of quartz, just really meant for decoration. Chisel chiseled quartz block, you guys can see the decorations just chiseled in. And then there's quartz stairs, so you can go up if you're building a house of quartz or whatever. Then there's pillar quartz block, again more used for decoration. And then there's a block of redstone, again could be used for decoration or an emergency backup of redstone. Okay guys, next thing I'm going to be going over is light pressure plate and heavy pet pressure plate. I don't think I need to show you guys what that is. Obviously, if you throw something light on the light one, it'll activate it. If you throw something heavy on the heavy one, it's going to activate it. Vice versa. Anyway, I'm going to move over to uh, this one. I know it's an anvil and a chest. Inside is a spawn zombie. So, what I'm going to show you guys is, if I spawn a zombie, uh, it would obviously kill me. But what I first want to name it, let's name the zombie, I don't know, Bob. Yeah, alright. Now, the difference is though, if I change my difficulty to normal, let's say, just uh, fix my render really quick. And I uh, switch my game mode to zero or survival and switch the time. You get to the time area, time set 1500, which is night. I'm going to spawn him. Now, watch what it's going to say once he kills me. Come on, boy, kill me. See, it says, Run Joyce was slain by Bob. Bob, oh shit. Shit, shit, shit. Go away! Ugh. Okay, let's just change my difficulty to peaceful. Bye bye, you fucking prick. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I hate spiders. Anyway, um, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, it says, I've been slain by Bob. So, that's pretty cool by naming it, it says what you're slain by. Uh, yeah, anyway, guys. So anyway, considering, now we're going to move over to the Daylight Center. Now this is the Daylight Center, it looks like a solar panel. It's nighttime, so obviously it's not going to work. But if we change the daytime, but, but if we change the time to, uh, daytime, or any form of that, it's activated. That's pretty cool for mob traps if you guys want to use that for. Next thing we're going to move over to you guys is, uh, this thing... And I forget the name of it. Please bear with me. It's called a hooper. Hopper. Whatever. Anyway, what it's supposed to do is if you throw something in there, it moves it to wherever it goes. Like into a chest or something. Now, I have levers here. So, technically, if I'm throwing some stone into it, it's just going to go straight in. And it's not going to move on to the next one. That's because I have a lever activated to it. So, if I take the lever... The lever off, and I throw this in. Throw some more in. It's going to go into this one. Okay? Now it's, now it's not moving into the chest yet, because it didn't activate it. So now it's in the chest. So, all together, if you throw something in there, it's going to move it all the way until it reaches a chest or the end of the line. So I think that's pretty cool. I like it. I could definitely use it when I play survival and different things. Now, uh, the next thing we're going to do is a le is a redstone comparator. Now, what it does is it basically, uh, <coughs> excuse me, comparates, uh, compares how much an item is worth. So, if we want this thing to be able to power itself fully, we switch it on by right-clicking it, and let's we're going to put in a diamond sword, which is worth quite a bit in the chest. So now those lights are on. Technically, that's basically how the comparator works. Just extracts the energy from it, from each other. 
from the object. Blah. All right. So now, last but not least, this is the best bit: a Minecraft, a Minecraft cart with TNT. Probably one of my favorites. Now, there's two different things you could do with them. First thing, if you want a slow one, like a slow explosion, you just gotta basically uh, have one activator rail. And one activator rail, activator rail basically just activates it for you, which is this thing, and it's already powered on by one redstone. So, I'm going to put one Minecraft, Minecraft TNT here, and it's going to blow up. Once it goes, I'll just give it a bit of a boost. As you see, guys, it blows up. Pretty cool, right? As for this one, obviously, I'm just showing you that's obviously a slower one. If you want to make it creep up on your things, this is obviously a faster one by just putting a redstone, uh, redstone booster thing, and it blows up faster. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, hope you liked the video. If you guys want to download the snapshot, just replace your Minecraft.jar with it. Link should be in the download. The download link should be in the description. If you guys like this video, please give it a like, comment, and subscribe for more awesome videos, tutorials, and gameplays. Anyway, guys, I'm MyMatCraft, and I hope you guys have an excellent day.